Hey, thanks for checking out the video today. Before us, we have Fried Cacts ASIC Miner Block Eruptor Cube. Yes, traded at 30 giga hashes a second guaranteed. I personally have seen them run around 31.5. Uh, it can be uh, overclocked, 38.4 uh, giga hashes, theoretical. It does typically run around 39 to 40 with uh, proper cooling. Uh, some nice cold ambient temperature doesn't hurt anything either. Uh, its power consumption is approximately 200 watts, 280 watts when overclocked. Um, I personally run them with 500 watt uh, Corsairs uh, with no problems at all. Um, Fried Cats definitely made a lot of improvements over the blade. Uh, this is actually considered version number three of the blade. Definitely consumer friendly. This time around, it comes with a tubular structure built for airflow, a built in 12 centimeter fan. Uh, it's pretty strong, but um, I do keep a house fan uh, blowing behind it just to give it a little bit of extra airflow. Uh, the unit comes with uh, built in protection, so if the fan fails, it's going to turn off. A bunch of relays in there. Uh, it's plug and play. You're going to need two uh, PCIe 6 pin connectors for the power supply. It's got the typical LAN Ethernet connection. Um, we're going to go around back. And it's got a boatload of different ports, which is really exciting. Uh, all the way on the left, we got a general micro USB cable, factory reset, a status indicator light. Basically the same concept as the uh, blocky Eruptor USBs. It's flashing when shares are found. Then we have the in-circuit serial port. I'd imagine that in the future we're going to see um, either firmware, firmware updates or tweaking of the uh, internal circuits. There's the in Ethernet uh, port. We have standby power LED, power LED. There's the two. Um, plug-ins for the power and then it has a 30 amp fuse which comes with them uh, yeah it's powered by the first mining ASIC uh, it's got six uh, mini blades from within um, these blades have 16 chips on each and uh, it gives a nice little GUI that you can monitor what it's doing uh, share wise rejected shares uh, its efficiency and just by a click of a button you can overclock it. It's pretty neat. It's a nice unit. Uh, it's got some weight to it. Definitely uh, sturdy. Um, what else can I say about it? And it can be yours. It's all ready to rock and roll. So as you see, um, it's, it's going to come double boxed. I'm going to go above and beyond with uh, packaging it processing it and getting it out to you as quickly as possible. I know how it is. Uh, when you buy something, you want it now, you want it fast. So thanks for checking out the video. Hit me up, let me know, and have a great day. Happy holidays.